Hi guys, welcome back to Life with Liz. Today I am bringing you my Aldi and Walmart grocery haul and meal plan. This lasts us for two weeks and I'm excited to tell you about this awesome free non-sponsored app that I found that is literally like a lifesaver for all of you that do all your Pinterest planning on recipes and then you got to write down all the ingredients. Don't worry, I will be telling you about this amazing app in this video. So let's start talking right away about the Favorite Eats app and then I'll run you right in to our grocery haul. This is the Favorite Eats app I am excited to tell you about. I am using the free version, but they do have an ad free option for $11.99 per year, so a dollar a month. This is the homepage where you can connect with your Favor Eats friends and see what they're recommending and making for their families. Next is the Explore page where you can search across all of the recipes and all the users. You can also search for recipes here too, like I am doing now for chicken recipes. The Me tab will show you all of the Pinterest boards you selected to use in the Favor Eats app so that you can see and search all of your favorite recipes. I am going to select my crock pot meals board and now I will select a recipe and add it to the recipe planner and you can select whichever day you would like to or add it to your queue for later. But once you're done, you can go to the planning tab to see your recipe planner. So you can see here what we will be having over the next two weeks, like bruschetta chicken. We have BLTs with cauliflower, mac and cheese, veggie loaded rotisserie chicken casserole. I'm excited for the chicken bubble biscuit bake casserole. And then what is amazing is that now you can go to the list tab and it lists out everything you need for these recipes. It divides it out by the department and as you can see, I already have completed items selected because I already had them in the kitchen. So as you shop, you can select the box next to the item and it will fall in this category so that it marks it right off your list. You can also add your own grocery items for things that are not recipe related. So everything's in one place. So be sure to come follow me over on Favor Eats. My username is Life with Liz, lower caps, all one word, as you can see here. And I will also share my link in the description box below. So super fun. Hope to see you there. Now let's get into our grocery haul. Okay, so here is everything that I got between Walmart and Aldi's for our two-week grocery haul. So I started off with some romaine lettuce. We're going to make some BLT, so I went ahead and got a loaf of bread as well. Um, I'm going to use whatever's left of the lettuce to make salads through the week. I got a couple different bags of cheese. I got this rotisserie chicken. I like to buy it already pulled. It's like $5 for the whole chicken to already be pulled for you. Worth it. <laughs> and then just some chicken breasts, two bottles of my favorite creamer, because you can't go wrong. I also went ahead and picked up two onions, a sweet potato, bananas. We've been eating banana peanut butter toast for like, I don't know, three months. <laughs> and Lily eats half the banana on her own. And then I also picked up her one of these. She loves these. So it's good for nights when we're eating something that's spicy or something that she can't eat. And some pouches. She loves this kind. It has four different food groups, which is great. And we're going to try out these oat smoothies. This is mixed berry, banana, and beets. And this one is banana, squash, mango, and pineapple. I think she'll really like these to go with her bananas for breakfast. <laughs> and then I got these tealess tea bags, or sorry, <laughs> tagless, not tealess. <laughs> they better not be tealess tea bags. And then I went ahead and also picked up some more liners. And Brian, some deodorant. And for all these, I got two packs of their portobello mushrooms. I am making a recipe for these, so I'm super excited for that. And also two zucchinis, package of cream cheese, some tomatoes for our BLTs, 
as well as these tomatoes for some bruschetta chicken I'm going to be making, broccoli, cauliflower, some peppers, beef broth, tomato sauce, crushed tomatoes, also heavy whipping cream, and needed some more garlic. I also picked up two packages of free range eggs because I have been just eating a lot of eggs here recently. And then another package of bacon. We have my parents' bacon that they had processed, um, so we'll mainly be using that, but Brian does like this kind, so I went ahead and picked up another one. And then I got two of my cold brews that I love. I got Lily some snacks, so I got her the yogurt bites. She loves these. She loves puffs, but I'm tired of paying so much for like a little container of them. So I think this is a better option and I think they're still just as healthy for her. So that'll work out great. And these are new. I have never seen these at Aldi before. I think she'll really like these. I'm hoping they're not too hard for her. Um, she has some star treats right now that are like from the baby section, so I'm hoping they're as soft as those, but we'll see. If not, I'll just eat them. And then also I got some LaCroix, apple and cranberry. I think those will be very good. I spent $54 at Aldi and $64, I believe, at Walmart. So just over $100.00 lasts us two weeks. We do have some meat staples in the freezer, so I don't have to get all of that. Thank you so much for watching my video today. I hope to get to interact with you over on Favor Eats and also in the comments of this video. Please like it if you enjoyed it. And also, if you're new, please subscribe. I'd love to have you on this journey with me. And I hope you all have an amazing weekend. See you Monday. Bye.